everyone and welcome back and I have another pregnancy update for you guys. This time I will just be doing a first trimester recap. So that's weeks 1 through either 13 or 14, I can't remember. But let's get right into it. So if you haven't watched the video where I announced my pregnancy as well as talk about how I found out I was pregnant, please go ahead and watch that now. I have that linked above and below for you guys. But let's get right into the first trimester, how that went. So quite honestly, overall, I will say that my pregnancy has been relatively, I've been blessed, I should say, to have a relatively smooth pregnancy. So some of the things that occurred in the first trimester was some of the symptoms I should say I experienced. Uh, food aversions, that was a really tough one because I really love to eat. Some of the things that I could not eat anymore just because I just did not have a taste for it and the thought of it just made me like, ugh, was chicken, beef, pork, like any type of protein, really. I just could not stand the thought of protein. So that was really difficult, trying to find what I could eat to still supplement my diet. There were times I had to force myself to eat because I just couldn't do it. Something else I experienced, this might be TMI, but constipation. And that was difficult for me as well because I am very regular. So to deal with not being able to go, that was a tough one. I did get a little bit of excess saliva, but that was very short lived. That was about probably week seven or so is when I experienced that symptom. I think it only lasted for like two or three days. Um, something else that happened that never happens to me. I am a relatively healthy person and I have quite a strong immune system. But of course, as you know, being pregnant, that does compromise your immunity. So I caught a couple of colds when I was pregnant. The first one I caught was while I was seven weeks. That lasted for like two weeks. That was rough. Um, and then I caught another one probably like a month later, around weeks 11 and 12. And that one was even worse than the previous one. That cold probably lasted for about three weeks. So yeah, that was pretty bad. It wasn't just your average cold. It was in addition to the stuffy and runny nose and a sore throat, like it was hard for me to talk. I didn't have a fever or anything, but I just felt so weak and so drained. But I was able to push through it. Something else in the first trimester, I did get my first ultrasound. That was at 10 weeks, only because the doctor, my doctor does not see pregnant women before the 10th week. So the ultrasound was just really just to confirm the pregnancy, got to hear the heartbeat, and that was pretty cool. It, it, it's just still, it was just so surreal seeing something inside of me that's growing and that's alive. The baby was very active, moving arms, moving legs. So that was just, I couldn't even tell you how it felt. What I will say though is, before then, yeah, I, like in my mind, it's like, yes, I took a pregnancy test, it was positive. But for the most part, since I felt okay, it's just the reality, did, the reality didn't quite set in yet. But once I saw my baby on the ultrasound, I was just like, oh my gosh, this is a part of me growing inside of me. This is amazing. So, uh, and really, there's not really a whole lot for me to talk about for the first trimester because like I said, I was blessed to have a very relatively smooth pregnancy so far. And I just pray that that continues. So if you have any questions, if you wanna know anything more about my first trimester, please leave them below, leave questions below, or just anything in general that you wanna ask, just leave that below for me and I will answer. 
please share this video with all your friends. Give it a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I just want to make sure I'm making videos that people actually want to see. And subscribe so you don't miss another one. And thanks so much for watching.